Hi, Nihon, I'm Chef Tam. Today we are making vegetable tofu hot pot soup. I got this cast iron pot here. I heat up some vegetable cooking oil with ginger and garlic. And first I got this shiitake mushroom. And this is a fresh bamboo shoot that you can get from the Asian grocery store. We're just gonna give them a quick stir fry. And I'm using medium high heat. And then I got this yu cai. I just made a video earlier. Yu cai is really good for you. You can buy it at the Asian store. It's just called yu cai. Smells so amazing. Very simple dish to make. A little bit of sherry cooking wine. It will warm up your evening. Trust me. Now, I'm just gonna add in cilantro with the stem. Enoki mushroom. I love enoki mushroom. And I got a bunch of yotai right here. And last, I need my cleaver. So I need to get this tofu in here. I'm using soft tofu. Very soft. Gotta be careful. Okay. And I add in some, just a plain stock. This is the stock that I soak it with the shiitake mushroom, so almost like a mushroom stock. Perfect, three cups, like that. And I'm just gonna uh, close it up. Put it in the maybe uh, light heat and let them simmer for a few minutes. After 10 minutes, beautiful. I can tell it's very healthy and if you like to add any seafood or meat, you can go right ahead. So I'm going to season some salt. I want it very light, not too salty. A little black pepper. Sesame oil. I'll give them a try. So pretty. Look at how light the broth is. Oh, beautiful. Oh, my goodness. Light, I can taste the inaki mushroom, the bamboo shoe. The fresh bamboo shoes taste different than the canned one. And if you buy the canned one, make sure you run through the water a little bit, wash off all those uh, uh, stuff in the in the can, those water, you need to get rid of those. And then uh, the shiitake mushrooms good, bamboo shoes good. I think we're ready to go. So toward the end, if you like to add some uh, fried shallot, just a little bit. That will get up a soup, another layer of flavor. That's it. I hope you liked the video. I'm Chef Tom. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. Bye. Hi, Li Hao, I'm Chef Tam. We are making Chinese traditional sticky rice with Chinese sausage, dry shrimp mushroom, bamboo shoe, and chestnut. I got some vegetable cooking oil, and this is shallot. I'm gonna stir fry for five to six minutes. Get them a really nice flavor. Infuse the oil. Seems like we need a little more oil. There we go. Next, we're gonna add in some ginger and garlic mint. Give them a quick stir. And then, I got some dry shrimp and shiitake mushroom at the end. 
Oh, it smells so good. Oh. Then we can add in Chinese sausage, Xiangchang, one of the best. A really nice flavor. Smoky, a lot of flavor. This is the fresh bamboo shoot I just got from the Asian market. Oh yeah, look at this. I got some roasted chestnut too, might as well just put it in. One big pot. <laughs> This is one of my favorite dish. Stir fry. Make sure you get all the flavor in there. We want to render the sausage a little bit. And the oil will give them more flavor. I cook for about seven minutes. With building flavor. Okay, I'm gonna add some oyster sauce. Saoxing wine. Soy sauce. Five spice powder. Oh, I love spice spice powder for this dish. Sesame oil. Look at that. Woo. Beautiful. If you have jiang you gao or dark soy sauce, will be good. I'm gonna add some black pepper. And now I got this. Glutinous rice. Oh, you can use short grain rice. Any rice you want. I wash a few times. And now I'm just gonna cook, stir until all the rice and all the ingredients incorporate together. Oh, look at that. I'm just cook down for a couple minutes. Make sure to mix it nice and evenly. Don't taste it yet. The rice not cooked. <laughs> okay, look at that. Next, I got two cups of rice and I'm just gonna cook with two cups of water because I want this a little bit dry and sticky. So right here, I'm using beef stock. Or maybe a little bit less than two cup. One and a three quarter. I think this is good. And I'm gonna use the same method to cook the rice. All right, where's my cover? The rice is hot, everything's hot, so they bring out to the simmer. I think this is about good. I'm gonna turn down to the simmer. I'm gonna cook for 20 minutes and then walk away for 20 minutes. Okay, I see you later. Okay, now it's ready. Look, I still can hear the scissors down at the bottom. So you're gonna add some uh, cilantro, or hot fresh chopped chili. Sometimes at home we add some chili hot sauce, squeeze some lime juice, it's very good. It's a very easy one pot rice that you can make at home. I hope you like the video. I'm Chef Tom. Thank you for watching. I see you next time. Bye.